Hi, I'm here with Wen Xuan Deng, who is the Chief Network Architect for Huawei's Corporate Strategy. And we're talking today about transformation. Wen Xuan, we're in a place right now where everything is changing in the industry. Talk to me about, from your perspective, what are the key trends that you see right now? To me, I think the most important trend is the network experience becomes the primary productivity. So the more or the better the experience, the more the volume of data the customer will consume, which is then bring more value. Okay. This is the biggest change, the biggest difference of data operation versus voice operation. Data rates and latency are keys for experience. But the user experience is much more than that. Proliferation of internet ap applications has established new user behavior. In short, ROADS, R-O-A-T-S. By that we mean real-time, on-demand, or online, DIY, and social. You know, I like what you said there about how as the experience for the user gets better, the user now has a higher demand for content, which obviously puts more stress on the network. What are some of the challenges that are going to come out of that? The fundamental challenge comes from the user experience, roles. This new established user experience is bringing challenges to all companies in all industries. Not only telcos, but also manufacturer, publishing, education, commercial, etc. But for telco, this role experience is mandatory. On the other hand, the ICT infrastructure that telco operators is operating is getting more and more complex. So, how a telco operator be more and more agile in such a technology environment which is more and more complex? This is a fundamental challenge ahead of our industry. Right, okay, and how do operators meet those challenges? First of all, we need to change our design philosophy. Think operation first, then the architecture of infrastructure. So, first of all, we, we believe we need a new operation system. With such a new operation system, road experience on customer side should be supported. And this new operating system should be designed as a product development platform instead of a supporting system as traditional. And Telco OS is a search solution that we are developing. And only if the ICT infrastructure itself is software defined, then the whole system can be ideal. Otherwise, nothing will happen. So Softcom is a certain architecture we introduced to the market since 2012 to enable a software-defined telecom. The last, but not least, a strategic partnership is key because this is a big change in the next 10 years. So we believe a strategic long-term partnership will be the key foundation to succeed and we are ready to move together with our customer. Okay, great. Wen Shuang, thank you so much for your time. Thank you for your time.